Workers underway at Little Mountain to stop dozens of residents turning right for quick access to Caloundra Road. Locals, though, aren't giving up, saying an independent traffic report supports their idea of a slip lane. Old Caloundra Road residents' right to turn right is about to come to a roadblock. 170 residents and a tow truck company exit from Old Caloundra Road. Within days, they'll be forced to turn left, drive 400 metres to a roundabout and loop back to Caloundra Road. So it's really going to come home and be a reality for all of us, yeah. Last August, residents offered Stockland and the Urban Land Development Authority a solution of a slip lane directly onto Caloundra Road. There have been no help whatsoever. The decision seems to have been made, and that's the end of it. They've spent $7,000 with engineers Adam Peckol Consulting for this traffic and transport report. It shows very clearly the slip lane between Old Caloundra Road and Caloundra Road is safe. It's at peak school times that traffic becomes an issue. People are going to be leaving 15, 20 minutes earlier than normal just to get back onto Calandra Road because of, because of the backup of the traffic. Traffic that will soon multiply when Bells Reach and Calandra South are built. Residents say there's a safety issue too. Bell Vista Boulevard remains the only way in and out of this burgeoning estate. There will one day be an accident. There will one day be a situation where a paramedic cannot get to somebody because the government, main roads and the LDA were simply short-sighted. Jennifer Nichols, 7 News.